I don't want to be a minister of sport, arts, and culture that pay for your funeral. I want to be a minister that empowers your life. I don't want to be that type of minister. So on the 15th, they can come and sit in the office after, in the month of October, they can come and toy toy, but we are going to be decisive to give this industry a voice because art is important. Culture is important. But you know what people do not know? Art and culture gets more than sport in the department. But people say we only care about sport. Mm -hmm. The reason why they can't see it is because of the squabbles, the infighting. We cannot. So they must be very careful how they approach our Ilkhutla, our Indaba. They must not come there with own selfish agendas. They must come there to help us seek a solution so that we can fully fund, equip, and then judge them. We can't give Netball South Africa money uh, and then not ask Netball to report back what they did with the money. The reason why we're going to give them more money this time is because they are reporting back how, how they spend the money. Now, if we give every Tom, Dick, and Jabulani, you know, and in the art industry, everybody with a fax machine, a dog and his neighbor is writing a constitution and then we must now recognize them. It can't go on like that. Thank you very much. You see, there's no workplace in South Africa where there's no corruption. Corruption is not specific to the Department of Sports, Arts and Culture. But there was something else that you don't find in other places that you found in the department. Where there were individuals, two types of individuals, Individuals that's politically connected, that threaten workers at the Department of Sports of Arts and Culture, that I need to get this because I'm going to call this minister, Minister Mackenzie. There were people that, that, that think that the Department of Sports of Arts and Culture is their father. It left them in inheritance. They are now acting like every, if they don't get money, they will tell us how corrupt the people are there. They threaten people to get money. There are people that say they are suffering, but go to their Instagram. That I know people that are suffering. Their Instagram don't have cars, bags, uh, Louis Vuitton bags, uh, uh, Gucci bags, Prada bags. But they come and say, we are suffering, we are not eating. But you are eating a bag of 70,000. So I'm saying that time is over. The monies of the department, we shall be transparent about it. We shall make sure that the ones that are corrupt in our ranks, we are coming for them. The first phase is first transparency. We now have had people that came out. They are now embarrassed, you know, when the list came out. They say, no, we didn't get money. But they got money, some of them. But they're now embarrassed that they got money for the wrong, they gave the wrong reasons. As far as the list is concerned, let me answer that one. I hear there's some voices that say, no, you're embarrassing people. What is, your government must help you. What is embarrassing about getting help from your government? There's nothing embarrassing. When I was in jail, my son, um, the mother of my child, got help from government. There's nothing embarrassing about that because the father couldn't provide for the child anymore. Now, why do you want to hide? Because you said that you are you going to do this with the money, then you go and buy a Louis Vuitton bag, or you went to go buy a golf for pa with the money of the department, and you didn't do what the money was intended for, and why you asked the money. Now, on that last point, poor people in this country stands in line for the sasa. You see them in the lines getting the 350. You with your 20,000, you want to be mzege zege. You don't want people to see you. Uh, you must not play with us. This is a new minister. Once you just fill in a form, you must know I'm going to tell the public we gave you money. We are not going to hide. I'm going to be transparent under my ministry. Oh, whether you got 20,000, we are now by the 20,000. We're coming to the ones that got millions. Anybody that got money, you must know your name is going to appear. You can call my friends 20 times. You can send politicians to me. You can do all that type of stuff. You can threaten me with a court. 
You must take me to court. Your one will even appear. I will fast track it. We'll jump a year. We are now, DG, where are we now? Uh, year 20? 22, 23. Look, we are now just, we are just about to get out of COVID. We are still coming. So we must, we're going to expose everything because this, this is not a state secret. People must know where the money went to. Thank you very much. I'll give over to the... Yeah.